El Faro crew member calls it a sign from God. The hard hat her husband was wearing when the ill-fated ship sank in October is back with her tonight. The story of how it got there sounds like something out of a movie. Channel 4's Ethan Calloway spoke with the woman about this unbelievable turn of events. Who's joining us live tonight with her story? Ethan? Rob, that widow says she has been spending the uh, past several months mourning the loss of her husband and the father of their kids. And tonight she says she is more certain than ever that he is still very much a part of their lives. Yeah, it's my baby's hat. It's an arrival Rochelle Ham never expected. Uh, we were married for 19 years. Her husband, Frank Ham, a crew member on board the El Faro, lost at sea during Hurricane Joaquin in October. The past nine months have been a time of adjustment and pain for the Ham family. We had the holidays. Um, Frank wasn't home. Birthdays, our wedding anniversary, all of those things. My daughter graduated. She, she won prom queen and everything, and it was very hard. But in December, someone found personal items washing ashore in Ormond Beach. Among them, this hard hat. They did some research and eventually traced it back to Rochelle's husband, Frank Ham. They weren't able to get in touch until just last week, and Rochelle and her family wasted no time driving to Ormond Beach to take back a piece of her husband. This actually, for me, um, it says that God has the last answer, and it's not over until he says so. And my faith and my hope level has just shot up <laughs> again. Rochelle says she believes Frank had a hand in getting the hard hat back to her, and now she has a new outlook on life without her husband. If I clean this up, it don't even look like it's been through a storm at all. It's in one piece. It's not disfigured and anything. So it's a sign of survival. It's a sign of grace and mercy. Rochelle says she plans to take that hard hat back to her pastor in her hometown of Baltimore after that. She says she's going to have it encased in glass in exactly the condition it is in right now. We're live tonight. I'm Ethan Calloway, Channel 4, the local station.